Hi guys, this is Phantom Vacuum Fan. Um, I'm doing something extremely different for me today. I am doing something that I have only seen once uh, on YouTube, and it wasn't ex as extreme as mine. Phantom Lightning did Fury vs. Thunder. I'm doing Fury, Thunder, Lightning, Cyclone XT. As you can see, I've tried to spread it way out, but I've put a ton of cat litter down. The orange stuff is that feline pine cat litter we use, as well as there's some catnip. Um, I've got the Thunder and the Fury plugged in. I'm going to, once I get done with their part of the test, I'll unplug them and then plug the Cyclone and Lightning in and do it as well. I'm going to go in order, though, of the machines where I've come out. I haven't run this test. I don't know who's going to win, whether it's going to be a draw. Um, but I'm going to start with the Thunder, then the Fury, then the Lightning, then the Cyclone XT. So let's see. Here's the Thunder. And I'm going to turn it on. Ooh, let me even this part out a little bit more because I don't want to give any one more of the pile, you know, that will throw off the test than, you know, the other. Okay, here goes. The thunder first. And the thunder did very well. I'm just going to take one more pass to make sure I got everything. Yeah, the thunder got everything. Now, I will go with the fury. I'll probably have to put some more stuff down. I'll try to save as much as possible. But let me just move the thunder out of the way a little bit because that way I can use my right hand for the camera, left for the vacuuming. Okay, here goes with the fury. Oops, I need to zoom out. Sorry. just that the underside of it has that it's slightly different than the thunders there's I think more of those uh, uh, little bars that go across the brush roll and you know, it didn't pick up as well in those areas but the areas that you know vacuum that had you know the suction and so on covering right away did perfect Okay, I'll unplug the Fury. And... Of course, I had a strategy error. Let me unplug the Thunder, too. I'm using the bathroom outlet for one and the... one well, of the bedroom outlets for the other. Okay, let me move the lightning a little bit over that way. Bring it over here. Yeah, I'll have to put some more stuff down for the cyclone. Let me put the camera down real quick to get everything set up. I'm going to turn on the lightning. Let me grab the foot pedal. And you won't be able to see the canister, unfortunately, because it's out of the way. 
but you can see actually how well the, the cat learns on its jumping. Anyway, let's zoom out and here it goes. surprise uh, and I, well, the, uh, I guess again it's the it's, it's the design just like the fury it uh, yes yeah, the brush bars don't yeah they prevent stuff from getting picked up like large objects and but what it did get to pick up it picked up well. Uh, now let me get some more cat litter and catnip, and I'll plug in the cyclone in the other outlet, and we'll, I won't put down too much more because I don't need that much more. Uh, smooth it out a little. Okay, take the catnip. Uh, let me take the cap off. There's like a shaker lid, but it doesn't really work. Okay, there. Now, let me put down the camera, plug in the cyclone, and then we'll be ready to try it. So far, I guess if I had to pick a win winner, I'd say the Thunder, uh, only because they have all what the you know what the brush and suction has been able to you know go directly over. They've all done equally, but the Thunder's bottom plate is slightly different, and so far it's left the you know the fewest little lines. Uh, okay, let me go from this direction like I've been doing, and here's the Cyclone. <laughs> Adjust the setting real quick. There. And yeah, the cyclone is doing the same thing that the fury and lightning have done. Except maybe slightly worse, but it's real close. Although uh, it's taking a few, yeah, a few more passes to pick up a couple things. So um, let me just move the lightning out of the way. I'll do a quick touch up just to make sure I got all the cat litter up so that mom doesn't come home and get, you know, be angry with me. I'll go from this direction for the rest. Okay, so, I'd say they were all extremely close. Um, as far as 
first pass, uh, the cleaning path being totally clean, the Thunder one. As far as first pass, what the brush roll was, you know, where I was exposed to the carpet and where the suction was as well. I'd have to say the Fury, Thunder, and Lightning tied, and the Cyclone may have even tied. It was extremely close. Um, the Cyclone seemed to leave just the slightest bit more. So I'm going to say it was a three-way tie with the Thunder, Fury, and Lightning, because really, you can't, you know, you can't blame it for that. It's just that the brush, you know, that's like saying, for example, I'll use the Cyclone as an example. Um, I'm going to put my hand over this so you just have that little, well, actually, here, I'll use the Fury. I'm going to, you know, like saying... Oh, well, yeah, there's, there's a you pretend my hand's a piece of plastic like the underside of the brush roll. Uh, yeah, well, yeah, it, it, that area it didn't pick up. Yeah, the, the area that's exposed worked just fine, but, you know, there was, well, you know, it's, of course it didn't pick up. There was something over it, you know. So, uh, and all vacuums really do that, so, unless they have just, like, a completely open bottom. So I'd say Fury... Thunder, Lightning, they all tie, and the Cyclone was a, a extremely, by the skin of my teeth, close second. Thanks for watching, this is Phantom Vacuum Fan. Uh, I just got a new HEPA filter for my Fury I haven't put, in, put it in yet because I wanted to wait till after I picked up all that cat litter and so on. Um, I'll do that shortly, and... I still have the surprise that I referenced last week to come, uh, not today, but I've got, it'll be coming in over the next few days, I'd say, or this week. Anyway, Phantom Vacuum fans signing off, thanks for watching, uh, talk to you later, bye.